It's so fantastic to walk in here. I didn't quite know what I was coming into, but coming in the door, it was like it's like all of Vancouver crammed into the Heritage Hall <laughs> with uh, with poster boards to boot. And I I really want to recognize you and thank you for all the work that you've done to represent your neighborhoods, to actually pull together in a cohesive way what your neighborhoods are, what they mean to you, what they mean to the people who live there, and to and to put that forward and make a political statement out of it because it's been it's been uh, the only thing really that pushed back effectively enough against the branding of eco-density. And when you say the word eco-density, well, it sounds kind of good. I, you know, it sounds reasonable and something we maybe should get behind. But the reality of it, I think, was very different. And it took a very, very intense effort on behalf of all of you in the neighborhoods to counter that effectively and to, to reframe the whole debate around what matters most. And that is community and our neighborhoods. Ultimately, it, when you think about what was most important, where you grew up, what's most important through your life, it's those connections to where you live and the people that you live with. And a lot of the problems that we have, not only in this city, but in, in cities and towns across the world, is when community starts to pull apart and disintegrate, and there isn't all that support, and people fall through the cracks, and they fall between communities. There's, there's a lack of cohesiveness, and that's where a lot of the problems, a lot of the social unrest and, and challenges that we have come from. So making our neighborhoods and communities stronger is so critical right now, and we can get a lot better at it. And the work that you guys are doing is about that, I think. It's about making neighborhoods stronger and making sure that we're, as a society, that we're better looked after by working together in our communities. So recognize you for that work, which is really important to our city, and beyond. We have a great opportunity right now with the big shift in the political winds to do things differently at City Hall. We talked about this a lot through the campaign, through this election, about how we want to do things very differently. We want them to come bottom up. We want the grassroots to have serious voice at City Hall. We want City Hall opened up. That's why we had our big inauguration yesterday at Sunset Community Center, because we want to be out in the community. <laughs> And it's more than just being us being out in the community, it's about the community being in City Hall.